It's no surprise the hospitality industry took a huge hit during the pandemic, and some owners claim it's far from over. CBS 3's Kendall Jarville shares how a new local restaurant is struggling to keep up as they prepare for a busy summer season. Cooking up delicious food is a lot harder when you don't have the staff. I thought sourcing food would be one of the hardest struggles, but really the big one has been hiring people. Tacos, Tacos, Tacos opened in downtown Duluth three weeks ago. Since then, restaurant owner Robert Giuliani says he hasn't found enough people to keep it properly staffed. Right now, he has four employees, but needs at least 10. Giuliani offers $13 an hour and says he'll pay more if they have experience. They ask what the starting pay is, and when I tell them, they're like, you know, I'll wait till uh, unemployment's done. He's referring to unemployment benefits many laid off workers have been getting during the pandemic. Minnesota Department of Employment and Economic Development Commissioner Steve Grove says a lot of factors go into whether someone takes a job. And despite workforce setbacks, Duluth is expected to see some growth. Labor force participation rate is still, you know, going down in Duluth, uh, but we think that'll reverse soon. And with the summer tourism season coming up, you know, we know that's a time of growth for the region. and. Uh, we're committed to working really hard with partners there to help make sure businesses have the workforce that they need. To connect workers with employers, DEED has a program that directs people on unemployment insurance to available jobs. There are actually a lot of good jobs available in our market right now, and many of them don't even require an advanced degree or specific training. They will train you on the job, which is great. Giuliani knew opening a restaurant would be difficult, but didn't expect a staffing shortage. I just want to make sure that everybody that comes to Duluth is taken care of and we give the hospitality that Duluth is really known for. In the meantime, he says service might be a little slower, but the tacos are worth the wait. If you are looking for employment opportunities, we have a link to Minnesota's deed resources on our website. By the way, Minnesota's unemployment rate was at 4.2% in March. That's down from 4.4% in February.